Okay, I'm sitting in the car, but don't get nervous. I'm not moving. Jerry Seinfeld's got a show like this now where he drives around with some comics and he tells jokes. They accuse him today on television of taking notes. Of course, you know, I ad-lib everything. It's off of my crazy mind. And he has friends with him and he works off the friends. Uh, see, I don't have any notes. I don't have any friends. <laughs> Uh, and I, I'm kind of uh, sad today because my bird died. Uh, I had a parrot. Parrot died. It, it never got a chance to talk. And, and also, Bob Schieffer has announced his retirement from CBS. He's had uh, one job for 46 years. I had 46 jobs for one year. And the other part of it, which you probably don't realize, is that CBS Television, which is a great organization, uh, has a show called Face the Nation. My show is Facebook the Nation. Uh, that's where you get me, or on City Watch, which is the uh, online service from Los Angeles where they put me on, and they complain that I'm in a car. Of course, everything is in a car in L.A. You're probably watching me in a car in L.A. <laughs> it's all going to be downloaded, and, uh, and, and what a load I am. <laughs> See, with my childhood, my mother and father never really gave me encouragement. It's not like America's got talent, which I doubt anyway that America has that much talent. But, you know, my mother and father used to, uh, I was toilet trained at gunpoint. And uh, and when I had to make, what, you know, which we call going to the bathroom, uh, my mother and father used to applaud. And uh, I never got over that. So now that I'm an adult, uh, I still require a round of applause to go to the bathroom, which is rather inconvenient at Starbucks when you use the men's room. It always, it, it works in a club, though, when you're on stage and people applaud, and, you know, you better wear it depends. Uh, but you know, our, our, our society that has these TV shows that uh, where they don't pay anybody professional to perform, they have all these kids they're exploiting, people who want to be, and they're singing all the songs from my childhood. The original artists are, most of them are dead, and they're coming along with these kids who uh, want to be stars, and they have this uh, carrot in front of them. But the judges, you know, they use these, uh, these intimidation rules. Can you imagine raising your child in a beautiful home with a lovely education, and you, and you encourage a kid who has talent to be on television. And the uh, panel consists of Howard Stern, uh, Rosie O'Donnell, and Al Sharpton. Now, is this is this a way to live? This will send you to a therapist. I, I, I'm very, very upset about it. Can you tell? <laughs> I'm just jealous because I don't have one of those jobs, that's all. Because you get a lot of money. When you get a lot of money, you have power. And when you have money and power, then you don't sit here and do all of this on Facebook. You actually have a, you don't have to sit in your car and do that. <laughs> oh, all right. I've said, I've said quite enough. I'm, I'm, I'm out of here.